top-down planner strategy that has milestones. The task force led by Professor Fatuma Chege comprises membership drawn from key sectors will advise on transition of grade 6 cohort of the competency-based curriculum and standard 7 and 8 of the current 844 system. According to the implementation schedule, the transition is expected to take place in 2023. Education Cabinet Secretary Professor George Magoha has ordered the team to prepare a report on the transition process of pupils in grades 7, 8 and 9 before the CBC conference to be held on 16th August this year. For example, the issue of domiciling 7, 8 and 9. If you can take that and run with it. Because the country is restless and you can feel the pulse and uh, the busy bodies are out there, vested interests, self-interests, whatever you do, you want to know whether this uh, entity will be uh, domiciled in a secondary school or a primary school. So as you do the bigger work, there are certain things you must take and run with and give us report, if possible, even before the major conference. Professor Mago at the same time wants the task force to work on the CBC assessment for the reformed curriculum, which has been the subject of public debate recently. I think if you can dovetail this one, so that as you move along, you work with, uh, with, with NEC and give us a very clear direction as to, with regard to the competency-based assessments, you can see that is also drawing already, it's drawing blood in the press. Today they say there will be exams. How do you examine that? <laughs> Children of. The, they say there will be uh, birth certificates. People are saying all sorts of funny things. So we are holding our breath and waiting for you. So that as you move towards the whole picture, which will end up at the university, some of the quick takeaways you can give us. It would help us if we have a direction before the conference. On her part, Professor Chege promised to work closely with the relevant bodies to come up with a comprehensive practical report. We will sit down, plan a strategy that has milestones to be monitored and, and, and measured so that in the end we are able to say this is what we have covered. And I want to believe that uh, by doing that we will be able to give periodical reports, consultations, and uh, finally give a comprehensive report. Reporting for Channel One News, I'm Suleiman Yeri.